There is nothing worse than tiptoeing through the dog park because your neighbors didn't pick up after their dog. But that mess led to thousands of dollars in vet bills for one Highlands Ranch woman. And when her dog got sick again, she called Contact 7. My dog's name is Kona. He's a service dog. He's only a year old and um, he's a puppy. Little Kona looks healthy today, but he's on his second round of treatment for Giardia, a parasitic infection. At the end of October, he got really sick and um, he started having blood in his stool and, and vomiting. Brenda Ewing took Kona to several vets before Kona was diagnosed with Giardia. She has spent around $4,000 on his treatment and is now frustrated after hearing how he got it. Just people not picking up um, their feces from the um, yard and the grass area and stuff, and the dog park area. Kona was treated in December but got sick again just four days ago. Ewing says at the dog park at her complex and surrounding areas, it's a problem with people not picking up after their pets. A neighbor we spoke with agreed. I see poop everywhere. It's one of the responsibilities of owning a dog. You take bags with you. Um, it's, I don't think it should be the responsibility of the property management to pick up after careless, lazy owners. Ewing says when Contact 7 got involved today, her complex installed new dogway stations and started cleaning. But she needs her neighbors to do their part, if not for Kona, for their own pets. Most of the people that used to take their dog to the dog park, um, most of them, them people are sick, their dogs are sick and they um, need treatment. If your pet is ever showing symptoms like vomiting, diarrhea and being extremely exhausted, you're going to want to take them to the vet and get diagnosed and keep them away from any other animals and dog parks until they're healthy again. Reporting in Highlands Ranch, Jessica Porter, Denver 7.